I want to talk about why you don't have to label yourself. You don't have to stick to some kind of idea of, I'm a writer, I'm a drawer. Why constrain yourself? Make it about your experience and your learning and your journey and not about the label. Making lots of different types of things and not thinking to yourself, I'm a sculptor, I'm a painter. Use it to your advantage. Spread yourself out and start to get better at all these things. Putting yourself in a box and labeling yourself is a, is a poor move strategically. What you should be doing instead is following your interests and saying, do I like doing this? You don't have to be a writer or an artist or an activist or anything. You don't have to stick to being that thing you said you were just because you thought you needed to or someone said, keep going, don't quit. Everyone is multidimensional. We can all do different things. We can all learn in different phases. And we can come back to that central self and we can push some art forward. And it doesn't have to be any label. It just has to be created. We're fluid beings who exist on a spiritual and physical plane. And we change all the time. And that means our tastes, the things we want to do, the things we think are good, are idols, our inspirations, all of those change depending on life. You're living through a life and nothing is set, including who you are and the type of art that you make. You're an artist, but understand that being an artist means that you're not a label. You're not a label. We are the reality creators. That's a promise.